friend. Rufus, boy. All right, Rufus. Look at me. Working the white man's land for no pay. How will I let this happen? Look, if... If you need money, I'll get you money. <laughs> I'm just joking with you. Right now, this is good for me. Be quiet! No, you be quiet. No, I'm having a moment of repose. Well, you should be working. Oh, I, I've done my work. Not how I heard it. Oh, you should be grateful. I'll be grateful when you get off your behind. Oh. Oh. Oh, I'll tell you what, woman. Was a damn sight more peaceful round here before you came back. You're just lucky I'm a soft touch. I should sling you out by your ear. Ah, oh, you always was a cold-hearted lizard of a woman. And you always was someone willing to live off the efforts of others. It's walk or work, old man. I've got lumbago. You'll have more than that in a oh, minute. Oh, John, tell her about my health. Do what the lady says. I'll work my fingers to the bone Building this place, Abigail Roberts. Marston! Abigail Marston, Miss Marston to you. Miss Marston to you. Why you let him stay? He's actually been pretty useful in a useless sort of way. Who's that? No idea. Friend or foe? We'll soon find out. It's the Gettys boys. From Proghorn Ranch? Yeah. Mr. Milton! Mr. Milton! Duncan! Sir, Ma found some old furniture in the attic. Pa thought maybe you folks would want it as a housewarming present, you know? Uh, they send their regards. Uh, how kind they are. Tell your Ma and Pa we're very touched. Where would you like the furniture? Uh, just over here. Then we can arrange. This is real kind of y'all. You saved the ranch. Pa said this is... Well, that's about everything. <clears throat> send your Pa my best regards. Tell him... He's got friends for life in me and my family. Bye, sir. Ma'am. I can't believe this. It's so kind. Sure. But there's still some more things that we need to get. How about we take a ride into town? It's been ages since we spent any time together. It has. Let's go get the wagon. 